Good morning, YouTube. I don't know about you, but I am fucking cold. It has been that freaking freezing the last couple of weeks. Just around Melbourne. Um, just had frost after frost after frost. And I'm frankly already over it. But, uh, bring on springtime, I reckon. Anyways, on to the topic. Uh, I wanted to talk about what I do when I do the no perks, no attachments challenges for my weapons. Recently decided that I'm not going to reset again, reset my stats again, so I've started on doing all the camos for the assault rifles, and I've got most of them up to this stage, up to the no perks, no attachments. So, when you get to this, it's anyone who's done it knows it's really frustrating, especially if you play Domination a lot, as you just get basically grenade spammed and there's absolutely nothing you can do about it for the most part which is sort of the important part of this class that I put in there alright so the setup you want to run is you want to have your primary weapon so the gun that you're up to all of the challenges with then you put on overkill if you have a, put on overkill if you have a second weapon that's at this same level um, if not you can put on a pistol and run the secondary gunfighter two attachments on it, so your boss has pistol to switch to, and run out of ammo or whatnot. Um, then put on danger close, and get two of your lethal of choice, which for me at the moment has been frag grenade. Um, I'm kind of over the C4, it's, it's too many weird glitches with it in this game. I know frag, frag grenade's more versatile I guess. But yeah, and the important part is the two trophy systems, and that should take up all of your 10 points running like that. Uh, the trophy systems save you a lot of grief trying to play Domination without any perks. Check out this Hellstorm, by the way. Oh yeah, five man. I'll take it. <laughs> but yeah, um... And it also means that you can still play the objective to some extent, which is why I chose this gameplay, which I got yesterday, where I'm, I get something like, like 23 defense or something by the end of the game, about 6 or 7 caps, which are mostly B flags, so not, not a bad effort. One of the other main struggles that I have with the assault rifles when I'm doing these challenges is uh, not having stock. It, like I keep trying to rush at people and just I just get mowed down because I can't get my gun up quick enough or I can't straight around corners and forget how slow it is with the outstop. So you definitely have to play a little bit more defensive and uh, play like more of a bitch basically and just post up a bit more often. So that's the way to approach it. Um, anyway, that's pretty much the gist of this. What I do with no folks, no attachments. Uh, I'm probably going to do one on how I get the headshots. Uh, self-explanatory stuff, but yeah. Anyways, have a good day. Don't freeze to death. Ciao.
objective. Securing C. 